guys. I um, hope y'all are having a good week. We are going to be talking about goodness and our fruits of the Spirit this week. Um, so we often say that God is good. Our parents tell us to be good. Do you think that the two meanings of these words good are the same? So that God is good and our parents tell us to be good. Do you think that we can confidently rest in a goodness of God that would look like the goodness our parents are telling us to be? When Galatians tells us that goodness is a fruit of the Spirit, it is talking about much greater and much deeper than outside behavior. When our parents tell us to be good, oftentimes they want us to be polite, not fight, clean up right away, obey right away, or any other behavior that they want out of us right then. But the goodness that we have in Christ and the goodness of God is not simply behavior, it's heart posture. Goodness is love, humility, forgiveness, integrity, honesty, and compassion. These are much more than just being polite and doing our chores, isn't it? Man, all of these things sound so hard, don't they? But all of those things encompass who God is and what his character is like. 1 John 1, 9 teaches us that he graciously forgives when we repent. Psalm 136 tells us that his love endures forever. Philippians 2 teaches how Jesus humbled himself to leave his rightful place in heaven to come to earth to save sinners. Jesus did all of these things perfectly, but we as sinners, we fail every day to demonstrate goodness. It is only with the help of God that we are changed. Philippians 2.13 tells us it is God who works in you, both to will and to work for his good pleasure. So when we strive to learn how God wants us to live, when we pray for help, when we pray for growth, God will change us to look more like Christ. When we say God is good, it doesn't mean that only happy and fun things will happen in our lives. Hard things do happen and scary things come into our lives, but we can still trust that God is good. Remember all those things that goodness is? Well, we can know that even when things are hard, that God loves us. And he is doing what is best in our lives to make us look like Jesus. We know that his forgiveness is forever. So we know that the things on this earth are not as important as the forgiveness of God. When difficulty comes, we know that we must be humble to know that God knows what is best for us and that we can trust in him. When we have the choice to lie, to make ourselves look better to others, we can know that honesty is the better choice because we know that the truth is what God wants us to hold near. We have compassion on others and we care for them just as God has compassion on his children. It is impossible to do all these things on our own, but with God and with humility to allow us to be changed by him, we can work towards a goodness of heart, not just behavior that will make us more like Jesus. So you guys be on the lookout for one of these, these things to go in your packets and you can put your things about kindness in the back and then you can look forward to a week filled with learning more about God's goodness. Thank you so much, y'all. Have a good day.